Now, as North Texas grows, so does its housing problem. The need to make affordable housing a reality is at the forefront of many cities' agendas, from McKinney to Dallas to Fort Worth. And well, tonight, council members in Fort Worth, they're going to be voting on a measure that could be a game changer. A new proposed code change would potentially mm -hmm. force, compel builders who want to cut their costs to promise affordable units first. NBC Vibes' Alana Quillins live in Fort Worth this morning to explain just what that means. Alana? Good morning. Yeah, the big focus for all of this is neighborhood empowerment zones. These are parts of Fort Worth that are economically challenged and where the city wants to spur development and improvement. Now, in these areas, according to the code over the last several years, the city has offered developers of apartment complexes or housing developments a tax cut, in some cases up to $3 million, if they either set aside 20% of their units as affordable or pay $200 bucks per unit for five years. Now, the idea was the city could use that fee to build affordable housing elsewhere, but with the cost of everything soaring, of course, that fee is not covering enough to build something like that. And the policy, we're told, has not been working so well. In fact, the city says every developer in these zones since 2015 has paid the fee instead of setting aside affordable units. Now, leaders are considering getting rid of that buyout option altogether and then forcing developers who want those tax cuts to set aside affordable housing. Now, I spoke with Housing Channel, a nonprofit that supports lower income and working families across Tarrant County and DFW on the path to home ownership. And the math, they say, is looking good on just how many new affordable housing units this could bring to these neighborhoods that need it most. Well, for an example, if you've got a developer that's developing 275 unit complex, um, 20 percent set aside is about 55 units. So that's a great incentive. And that houses a lot of people uh, that, you know, can't afford our average rent of $1,900 a month, you know, so it's a great way for units to be able to be produced. Now, Housing Channel stressed the importance of this code change amid the affordable housing crisis in North Texas. COVID and the population boom have exacerbated that, but of course it's happening in a lot of metro areas across the country. They say in the last 10 years, home and rent prices have increased almost 25% here, but income has only gone up 9%, so there's a big disparity there. Now, if council passes this, it would go into effect immediately for all future project applications from here on out. Those that are already in the pipeline would not be affected by this change. We'll, of course, keep you updated when it all comes up for vote tonight at Fort Worth City Council. Reporting live in Fort Worth, Alana Quillen, NBC5.